What y'all doing out there in TV land, man? If you ain't tuned in to Kofi's universe, you slipping. That's why I go get all my info for Black Culture. He do the best album reviews I seen. You know what I'm saying? Dope rap reaction videos. He do it all. You heard me? Go to Kofi's universe right now. Subscribe to his YouTube channel. Man, stay in tune, loved one. That's how it's happening. Me. <laughs> YouTube salute, Westside Gun has cleared the air surrounding comments he made about Top Dog Entertainment in a previous interview after being corrected by TDE's Terrence Punch Henderson. Let's talk about it. If you're new to my channel, thumbs up the video, hit the subscribe button, click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live during an appearance on the Rap Radar podcast alongside Griselda Breffin. Conway the Machine and Benny the Butcher in 2020, Westside Gun said that he felt his collective's contributions to music weren't properly acknowledged during their blockbuster 2019 to 2020 run. All of this in one year, and we not mentioned as the top group, he said at the time. You still going to mention a TDE? You still going to mention a Dreamville? Dreamville, TDE, they incredible, but they didn't do it. You see what I'm saying? That's the Buffalo shit. That's the Buffalo shit that I'm talking about. If we were from elsewhere, we would be acknowledged the same way. Conway chimed in while Gunn concluded TDE is a powerhouse of 19. But where is Schoolboy Q, Kendrick Lamar, Absol, everybody's project? Punch TDE's long serving president seen to take issue with these comments and issued a correction on Twitter on Wednesday, January 4th, writing Powerhouse of 2022. Gunn replied to Henderson and said he meant no disrespect when he made those comments. I do want to say this on the record. We just don't like y'all niggas. We actually love y'all niggas. Always have. And I always said we just needed our respect from you. No who's. But it was always respect. That's what West Side Gun wrote back. It's all about timing. Um, that's good. So the change comes from Griselda's latest sit down with the Rap Radar podcast that was released Thursday, January 5th. West Side Gun took to Twitter prior to the episode's release and said that the interview had occurred a few weeks ago. All right. So how do I feel about this situation? That's good, man. That's good. They got that cleared up and. Punch gave him his props, gave Griselda their props, excuse me, and Westside Gun said, hey, man, it's all love over here. I mean, think about it. In 2019, TDE wasn't doing nothing. Schoolboy Q did drop an album. He, he dropped Crash Talk, remember? He dropped that. You didn't hear from Kendrick for a while because, remember, at that time, he was the curator for the Black Panther soundtrack. Then J-Rock did drop an album in 2018. He dropped the album. Wait, Redemption? Yeah, then 2017, Kendrick dropped down. SZA came out in 2017, 18, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. Absol didn't come out until 2016 with his last album before he dropped in 2022. SZA came out in 2022. I mean, you had other artists that came out, but they wasn't like the the top juggernauts over there for um for um TDE. But if you look at Griselda's you know, run, they, they're doing their thing. Like in 2019, 2020, it was dropping heat. Westside Gun was dropping a project. Benny dropped, um, what, the plugs I met? Yeah, the plugs I met, whatever. He dropped that. Um, what, Conway dropped the EP. He dropped the EP. In 2020, they killed it. Benny dropped two projects. Did he dropped no 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 Benny dropped one project excuse me he dropped one project he dropped Burn the Proof Conway dropped from King um to a God he dropped that project with um the Alchemist he dropped that project with um Big LTD Westside Gun dropped um Pray for Paris in 2020 you see what I'm saying they got they run going they got they run going they they get the momentum is there. You know, um, Benny the Butcher dropped the um, the stuff with um, Black Soprano Family, BSF. So all this stuff is going on. In 2021, they're dropping more projects. You see what I'm saying? They're dropping more projects. You know, so all this stuff is just like, wow. Like, you know, everybody was just shocked to see them doing, 
doing their thing when I wasn't, but it's like, damn, they got the momentum. So you got to give them the momentum and the momentum was shifted over there to them. Doesn't mean they were selling like five, six million copies uh, um, a record. I mean, as far as like the album that was coming out, no, but it's okay. The stream, they got the momentum. People was talking about, you know, Griselda, 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 Griselda. And then 2022, Rome Street's coming out. Then Stove God Cooks is signed now to Griselda. Then Bodie James is dropping his projects in 2020, 2021, 2022. You see what I'm saying? That momentum is over there. Then you got um our Mary Cesar. She's dropping stuff. Uh, Rick um Griselda Subcamps, as far as like BSF dropping their projects throughout, you know, Heen, um, Rick Hyde, um, projects from drum work. They're dropping stuff over there. Seventh of Genius. You see what I'm saying? J Ski. So it's just been a great thing going on for um Mac Hami. That's another person from Griselda that was dropping stuff. So shout out to West Side Gun. Griselda holding it down. TDE drop projects in 2022. Kendrick, SZA. It was Kendrick last album, TDE, SZA, and Abso. That's three projects. War projects coming on along the way. I think J Rock is getting ready to drop something in 2023. And I believe, I don't know about Schoolboy Q, but you see what I'm saying? The momentum has shifted, y'all. You got to give props when props is due. And shout out to both of these camps bigging each other up. Post your comments below. Hoax Smash, Black Panther, the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Click the bell icon to be notified when I upload new content and go live. If you want to support and donate to the channel, I have Patreon. Patreon.com slash Kofi Universe. Venmo, Cash App, PayPal, Streamlabs. Everything's in the description. Until next time, salute.